Hey everybody, my crystals over here rocking on the table, if y'all hear it. So I wanted to go over uh, tonight's full moon in Taurus and the lunar eclipse um, in Scorpio season and what that means for each sign, what you're probably feeling. So full moons, they illuminate the dark. And moon is a feminine energy and it's about psychic insights. Um, deep emotions. So when the moon is bright, you're illuminating what was in the dark or what is in the dark, your hidden feelings, hidden emotions. So the moon brings that out in you for you to see it. An eclipse, it eclipses out the light. So all of a sudden you're in the dark again. It could be scary. So you could feel scared. Um, I actually, I woke up this morning kind of feeling that and I was like, oh, is this my intuition or is this just random fear? Did I eat the wrong thing? Kind of, you know, so it's elevated emotions. It's Pluto right now. Um, and Mars, it's scary. It can be scary. Um, Taurus is about security, reward. It's a steady energy it likes luxury, it's long-term um, home environments. Scorpio is uh, the eighth house of death, taxes, and sex relationships, long-term relationships. So let's go over what each sign is going through right now. And we'll start at Libra. Libra, you might be feeling uh, serious about your personal relationships passion, fostering connections, um, sharing your needs and values with your partner or anyone that you're dating right now is um, highlighted. You might be cuddly and snuggly. Scorpio, uh, partnerships, we're in the house of relationships, so focus. Um, the intensity of it um, might feel, I mean, be careful, okay? Taurus is about the throat, right? So uh, watch what you're saying. Um, you could be feeling very courageous. And if you've been in a long-term commitment of any any kind of relationship for a long, ter long time and you don't see it going anywhere, um, let's just say you're, you're just, you're going to feel elevated, so you could take big strides towards whatever you need to do, whatever you feel is right for you. Sagittarius, this is about your health and grounding. Again, um, it's speaking. So speak well, uh, kind of others, speak with loving words. Um, Capricorn, again with the body, you're going to feel flirty, um, playful, creative. You're probably going to want to dance more. Aquarius could focus on comfort and home. Um, kind of like a home improvement vibe where uh, it's coming up on the holidays. So you're going to want to get ready and entertain and um, cooking, you know, making everything pretty. Pisces, uh, this is a vibe of, I want to feel enrichment. So you might want to go have a really nice cocktail or um, a really nice dinner with candlelight, something that enriches your life, um, experiences of culture. Aries, uh, it's highlighted on money, so no gambling, okay? Because this is long-term stability. You want to be uh, smart right now, very conscious about your financial decisions. Taurus, safe and secure feelings. Um Again, it's a good time to talk about long-term partnerships or talk to people that you're in long-term partnerships with. Um, make sure your needs are being met. Gemini, this is a calm, a calming time. So um, tap into that unconsciousness, your unconscious mind. Read a good book. Pay attention to your dreams. Chill out. This is deep chill mode. Cancer, this is examining and protecting your relationships, any kind of relationships you got going on. Uh, you want to feel safe and sound, feeling secure. Leo, there's an emphasis on career and having fun. 
um, more security. Also, Jupiter is trying the sun. Anyways, it's a really happy, lucky energy. Um, so emphasis on career and fun, more security, long-term um, balance in assets and work. You're going to be looking at uh, the projection of the future. So I hope that helped. Again, this Taurus energy is really, really strong. And this eclipse could intensify some deep feelings that you don't even know they, they were there. So hidden things could come up um, and speak well, speak kind. Let's be kind to each other, right? See you all next time.